public practice. Seems like it went uh, pretty quick, but uh, I want to thank the fans for coming out. I, I really do think that when the fans are out here, it, it adds a lot uh, to the practice, and um, you know it's great. It, it just uh, always appreciate seeing our fans. So um, last practice until uh, next year, I guess, out here. But um, well, I'm really happy that. That uh, obviously he's been clear, you know, cleared to uh, participate. So that's that's a great thing. You know, anytime it's a medical you know deal, that's uh, you know that's where you just pull it for the individual. You know, you know how much he wants to play and things, but um, you know, really you couldn't do anything about it. We couldn't comment on on him until uh, until he did get cleared. So uh, you know me, it doesn't take. A lot for me to get distracted. So. Next question. Uh, yeah, to lay something out there on them and, and you know an expectation on them. Let's let's let him get through some of these things and then maybe we'll have a better idea. But obviously it's been a long time since he's been out here and uh, you know I think we're all excited to, to see him work and really happen. Yeah, well I, I you know I think that's. Uh, you know, that's a great thing. You know, you, you see how much a guy wants it. Obviously, you got um, major adversity in front of you, but there's only one way to do it. He's got to be the guy that uh, that does it. So, um, um, you know, it's great to see. Well, first off, the, the five I feel good about, but really, I, I think Quanjo has been a guy that's really stepped up. I mean, he, he's done a tremendous job at left half of course filling in for 40 Glenn and, and he's starting to play really well and uh, and Roy is is a guy that you know we we're looking for that swing center guard type and, and uh, he's pretty you know he's uh, made a pretty good account of himself right yeah to be that backup absolutely yep well you're always looking to improve even you know even from the defensive side I mean we'll sign up for that every week However, there's still some things that you know we got to keep uh, keep working on, and and, uh, and we will. You know, there might be little things, but uh, you're never going to be satisfied. You just keep working, and, and that's what we'll do. And and as far as uh, maybe I should scream real loud or something. But uh, see, I would. <laughs> but and then uh, you know, offensively, you know, just keep uh, just keep you know grinding out uh, some things. They did some good things. They started blitzing the heck out of us, you know, on some of our sweep runs, and so they made a couple of big plays against us. Well, we feel pretty, you know, pretty good about it. Obviously, with Shady, like, you know, you got a, a Pro Bowl running back uh, heading the list, so that's pretty good. I think Reggie Bush is, uh, you know, is, is somebody that we know that we want to keep fresh, but he's still, you know, got a lot of juice left. And then Gillis Lee, I think, is is. Uh, Probably the number two back right now, and then the uh, young kid Williams, and, <laughs> and then uh, it was good to see uh, James Wilder uh, have a bounce back game, and, and more of the fact that he had those dumb penalties uh, the first first game, but then he, he did a, a tremendous job really on special teams this past week. I talked to him uh, a little bit that day, you know, in the locker room. I talked to him a little bit. Did you see some, some of the photos, Rex? I got really nothing to say, you know, uh, more about it. I, I think, you know, I spoke about it after the game, and, and I, I believe the team issued a statement. So I think I'll just, I really have nothing else to add.